the past hour, we got a description of the car that fled the scene of a deadly hit and run on the main line. It happened at the corner of Ardmore Boulevard and School Road in Ardmore. Eyewitness News reporter Greg Argos is live there with what we've just learned. Greg. Yeah, Jessica, police officials are actually searching for a the driver of a white Jeep Grand Cherokee who they say hit a 51-year-old man at this intersection around 5.50 this evening. Shortly before 6 Thursday evening, Lower Marion police rushing to the intersection of Ardmore Avenue and School Lane. Reports pouring in of a person struck at that intersection. When officers arrived, they found that injured person and rushed the victim to Lankanaw Hospital, where the pedestrian later died. What police did not find, however, is the driver who they say fled the scene. Why would you want to like, live with that for the rest of your life? Jay Breslin works just yards from the intersection where this deadly hit and run happened and says drivers often speed down this straight stretch of road. There's a crosswalk right there, but people just, yeah, you know, treat it like it's not even there. Like I've seen people before, like, yeah, cars honking at pedestrians walking in the crosswalk. And it's like, dude, it's a crosswalk. Wait for the people to cross. Other people who live near the scene. I'm surprised it hasn't happened before. Say they simply don't feel safe walking down the block. There's people just fly down here. Now, Yuki and Jessica, an employee at a local restaurant just down the block here, tells me police have been inside that restaurant. They've obtained surveillance video of that white Jeep Cherokee. They have not yet released the video to the media, but as soon as they do, of course, we'll pass it along to you. If you happen to know the operator of that vehicle, contact Lower Marion Police. I'm live here in Ardmore, Greg Argos, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Okay, Greg, thank you.